Hello my YouTube subscribers, I'm here with another e-liquid review. Before I begin, I want to talk just a little bit about this iGo W3. Um, I gotta admit, this was a pretty good suggestion from uh, one of my commenters, so I'm pretty thankful uh, that I went ahead and purchased it. Um, like I said in the last video, um, I think it's offering a better flavor. Um, I'm still not going to do a review on it yet. Um, one thing I despise about this device, though, is that I got a drip on it. I've been vaping on it. I've uh, been doing some uh, coil wraps with it and uh, just all around playing around with it, trying to get used to it. And uh, it's pretty good. So I got a brand new build here. And uh, let's take a look at it. It's, again, it's a uh, um, dual coil, 8 wrap, micro coil with uh, 28 gauge cantle wire. You know, I'm, it's not the best... I'm sure, uh, but I haven't decided on which direction I want to go when I start playing around with builds. So, um, I like it. Uh, I really do. I don't like that uh, I have to drip fla uh, fluid into it all the time. I do think it produces better vapor and better flavor than my Aga T2, which has been sitting over here feeling quite lonely for itself. Today I'm going to review Scorpion, and uh, this is from uh, last month's sample box. I have not received this month's sample box, but hopefully that's going to come in the mail today. And I'll record a couple videos today, one of them being uh, an unboxing, and uh, maybe a third with uh, these, or fourth with these last two flavors that I got to review. Now, I had this open up in the web browser another day, and I was reading it over. Let's take a, a whiff of this. I think this is like a citrusy scent, scented uh, flavor to it. It's got a kind of a pineapple. Right away, I want to say that it's a pineapple flavor. Maybe I even read what this is. It's weird because it kind of smells... The pineapple flavors that I've been smelling kind of smell like a weird butter. So it's kind of fruity. It's kind of citrusy. Um, I'm going to... Okay. The safety coil or whatever the heck that was surprised me coming off. Now, I haven't tested this uh, Wiccan coil yet, so I have no idea how she's going to vape. But it uh, should be alright. It should be com comfortable putting these uh, on now that uh, once I saturate it, should do alright. Look at the coloration on this. Looks like piss yellow. That's kind of weird looking. Let's take a look at this from the uh, um, uh, drip tip so we can see the viscosity of it. I, l I always like to see the viscosity of it, especially when I don't know what the uh, the PG-VG ratio is. If it comes up really fast, see, it's not coming up super fast, but it's not super, super slow. So I would say this is about 60-40 um, or in that, that vicinity. It's not 50-50. It may be a little heavier than 60-40, but... Um, I doubt it. And then uh, anything lighter than that would probably be 70-30. Uh, it's got a weird, like, almost fluorescent yellow to it. Let's take a vape on it. I'm betting it's, uh, um... Let's see how this, uh... This wrap, uh... Let's see how this build burns. How it vapes. Look at that. So I'm betting it's gonna be, like, a pineapple flavor to it. Um, I don't know... Uh, let's find out. It's got a pretty good throat hit. Uh, okay, it's 18 milligrams. Um, God, what was that? It's like cream almost. Almost like peaches and cream. Horrendous throat hit. Oh god, 18 milligrams. I think this is the first 18 milligram bottle that I've flavor that I vaped on this thing. Still, it's hard to hit. I need to get some water. Oh man, I can't stand that much that much nicotine. Uh, let's see. 
Let's try this again. Hold on. Vape's good. But at about 60, 40. Oh. That's so much nicotine for me. That's too much. <coughs> so, it's almost like the throat hit. The nicotine content is just overpowering for me a little bit too much. And um, it's hard for me to actually taste the actual flavor. But I'm, I'm thinking like right now it's like a peaches and cream flavor. I'm not 100% sure. I'm going to get one more rip on this. And, uh, God, I wish they would stop sending me 18 milligram uh, e-liquids. It's really hard to, to get, like, a really good idea uh, when it's so much over what I normally vape. It's got a weird creamy flavor to it. I can't describe it. I'm going to hit up the... The old Firefox here, and uh, we'll see here. Bonsai Scorpion. What's uh? What's this say? Toffee. Our signature tobacco blend with hints of toffee and that awesome gruff tobacco undertone you're looking for. This bonsai flavor is a perfect mix. Toffee. So that's what it is. It's not pineapple. It's not fruity. It's toffee. No wonder it smells like butter. With a awesome gruff tobacco undertones. Let's get another rip on that. See if I can actually taste that. I don't really taste the, the tobacco flavor. Vapor production is pretty good. <coughs> Throw it hit is intense with 18 milligrams. Yeah. Made my fingers tingle. Toffee, huh? Ah. <coughs> I can't say I'm a big fan of this right now. Can't say. It's got an interesting flavor to it. Um, you know, the toffee's kind of sweet. It really, it tastes like a cream to me. More, you know, more like a, a sweetened cream. So I guess maybe that's where I, I'm. I can't say I'm enjoying this flavor. It's a sweet flavor. You know, if you might if you like sweet flavors, you might like it. Me, I don't I don't think I like it. I like some sweet flavors, but not all of them. And I can't What the fuck, man? Hints of toffee. What kind of toffee? Toffee is a confection made by caramelizing sugar or molasses. I'm thinking like caramel. When I think of toffee, I think of caramel. Along with butter and occasionally flour. Well, I guess that's why it smells like butter. I don't even know what toffee is. I don't eat toffee. I don't like this. I gotta be honest. I don't really like this. Um, the flavor's not for me. Uh, if you like toffee, you know, I guess maybe that's right up your alley. I don't eat toffee. I don't. Um, I don't know. So I guess I'm probably the worst person to come to when reviewing this flavor. Because toffee is not something I enjoy. I, you know, I don't partake in toffee. Um, so I don't really have any, like, idea of what toffee should taste like. Now, as for the gruff tobacco undertone, I, I don't know if I taste it. 
because I don't know, I guess I would say I'm not tasting it. So, I don't know about this one. I would I would say I would def I I definitely would not hunt down scorpion from bonsai. Um, it's just not a flavor for me. Uh, maybe they got an e juice that I would look at. I don't know. Vapor production is good. I like that. I mean, that's a definite bonus when you see a nice cloudy vapor like that. I'm gonna have to put this down. I don't like that at all. So, looks like they got some other ones here. Uh, sweet guava, guava, chocolate chimp. I don't know. Futterbinger. <laughs> Futterbinger. Uh, all right. Well, this is bonsai. Uh, scorpion and I can't say I don't I mean I can't say I like it I can say I don't like it in fact I don't I like it so little I might actually throw this one away I absolutely I don't think I can vape any more of that sorry now if you like this video go ahead and click like uh, feel free to leave me a comment. I do try to respond to all of my commenters. And if you haven't clicked subscribe, go ahead and click subscribe now. I'm going to be doing more reviews in the future. And I'll uh, probably do some more uh, recordings today. So you'll see me dressed like this for a few videos. Until next video, bye.